been a little bit since I posted. I do apologize about that, but I actually did just get on to the game. It is currently like just around 6 p.m. where I live, and yeah. So basically, as you guys clicked on the title, or what you guys clicked on the title for, is um basically what season six season six is changing or and predictions about what is gonna be like season six is gonna be in the next well in fortnite what is going to change about fortnite and how the whole gaming platform could either attract more people or lose players um obviously i'm still going to be playing it because i have to make these videos for you guys kind of inform you guys and everything like that but just to start out as you guys can see stuff like this this right here um if you guys have never even seen these things before they've been around for a while um i'd say probably since like for a month maybe three weeks um but the, all the circles around the map and that does kind of that was kind of like the first sighting of stuff like how season six is really going to change fortnite and especially when the cube started to be in play at first it was just all the way out here in paradise um which i actually do have clips right before it did go up i was actually going to post a video about it but uh it didn't really work out, but um, before everything blew up, I, I did take clips of it, and I might end up showing you guys those clips at the end of me and my friends, basically just fucking around around the cube, um, kind of just, I don't even know, um, messing around, doing whatever, it's a lot of fun, the cube, a lot of fun, but now the cube is all the way down here at Loot Lake, which as you guys can see is what, exactly what I'm jumping on, trying to find a gun before I get ass raped like I'm about to right now, but uh, yeah, I'm probably just going to get out of here. But, um, if you guys, you guys probably know about this, unless you guys are away from, like, your console or something like that, then you guys still might want to stick along. But, um, for my predictions, basically, on what the next season is going to entail, as you guys know, the Valkyrie skin, that just came out. Alright, guys? And so did the, um, what's it called? Uh, so did the, um... Well, the Valkyrie and the Ragnarok skin, they're all basically like Ice Age, kind of, uh, more or less, um, kind of like, I don't know, Viking era, but also kind of more like Frost. And now, what I'm taking from that, and with the whole cube thing, one, that the cube might destroy the map and totally turn everything into kind of like a Viking thing. Because, well, like I said, this, right, even right here, the glider, the frost wing, it's ice. It's starting to get everything starting to get in like frost topics. I mean the Valkyrie, the Valkyrie, the girl version of the Ragnarok skin or Ragnarok, whatever you guys want to call it. It's it's the girl version of this guy right here. All right, and especially with uh, how there's the the Viking ship in the game and everything like that. My whole entire guess is that um, the the cube, like I said, is going to destroy the map, or totally make something like how it did in season, the beginning of season 5, now when the, basically like the sky just turned all freaking, like, I don't know, like lightning-ish, and just boom, there came paradise, and there left moisty rip, um, but, stuff like that, now, but, like I said, it's probably going to turn the whole map to ice, fog, like, Viking era, probably gonna add more ships at loot, lake, and stuff like that, but, what's really, what's really kinda making me mad, is, um, I know they might get it where, get rid of some of the, um, not, some of the spots that people don't go to that much, kinda like whaling, if you do go to whaling, you're probably one of the smart ones, I do go to whaling a lot, um, but it is just not that popular. Tilted, they'll never get rid of. I mean, it is kind of funny how they did make it cause a huge fiasco slash scare out of everybody. But yeah, that was kind of that was kind of funny. And I also think Paradise Palms right over there is actually going to turn into like something like ice something. Like I don't even know. But yeah, like I was saying, guys, the waterfall with the ship should actually be. It's, I think it's all, yeah, it's all the way over there. It's all the way over there on that little, you can kind of see like a little lake type thing on that hill. Um, stuff like that. But yeah, guys, so that's basically my opinion or what, my, what I think is going to happen and have like two Fortnite and season six. Hopefully you guys do enjoy this video and hopefully you guys, um, 
are enjoying how are enjoying the other videos and stuff like that if you guys are new to the channel make sure to subscribe and things like that and hopefully one of you guys might DM me or whatever and if you guys do want to play um, you guys are always welcome to play with me um, I'm normally on just PlayStation on the weekends um, US standard time basically um I live up here in Alaska, so it is kind of weird. I'm one hour behind California time. So if you guys ever do want to play, all you guys got to really do is comment and ask. And you guys do have to be subscribed. I only do play with subscribers. I mean, which, if you guys aren't subscribed, it kind of sucks. But there's really nothing to lose if you subscribe. Really nothing at all to lose. I mean, thank you guys for tuning in the video. And like I said, we also are doing a giveaway with the 3D printed V-Bucks and the... Omega and then like the whatever thing, but yeah, that's all gonna happen very soon. And I <laughs> let's see if I can get this elimination before I do sign off. Um, it has been a pleasure with you guys today, and uh, well, I guess I'll see you guys tomorrow or next time. Um, I'll probably post another GTA video, one of my familias or what mafia vids today. I mean, that should be a lot of fun, but um, yeah, I'll see you guys later, and well. Peace out.